If your objective is to sell sharks on the Grand Exchange, this is the video for you. This is my approach to getting level 99 in fishing and cooking. To go from 1 to 99 fishing, you're going to start in Lumbee in your inventory with a fishing net, a bait fishing rod, and your best hatchet. We are going to go fish shrimp and cook it. This guide is all about the perfect marriage between getting 1 to 99 in a, in a quick enough pace, but also making good money while we do it. So we come up to this bridge, we go just to the left, and we are going to fish shrimp. You need 210 shrimp in order to get to level 10 fishing. We are also going to cook these shrimp as well. So you've caught a full load of shrimp. The best place to cook your shrimp and start leveling your cooking alongside your fishing is going to be inside the castle and there is a continuously burning fire right here. Alright, when your fish is done cooking, you just throw the shrimp on the ground. It's not worth banking. So you now have level 10 fishing. We're going to go catch herring now. Now we will revisit that same cooking fire when it comes time to cook the anchovies and the trout. The best place to catch herring is north of Lumbridge. There's a pathway that connects Lumbridge and Varrock. There's a bridge. Just to the right of that bridge is the best place to fish herring due to the fact that there is a place to chop down trees and you can level your cooking at the same time. As you approach the bridge, like I said, it is just off to the right. You get out your bait fishing rod and you catch herring. You will need 106 herring in order to reach level 20 fishing. Once your inventory is full of herring, you go cut down a tree and you need to cook this herring on spot. Otherwise your cooking level is going to fall behind later on. Cooking the herring is a little tedious, but it has to be done. Once you have 15 fishing, you're going to switch back to your fishing net and follow this path up towards the cooking guild. Once you get close to the cooking guild, there is an area that you can fish for anchovies. The best way to get there is you walk along this wall, continuing to head north. As soon as you hit the stone path, you turn left, and there will, there will be a pond with multiple spots to fish anchovies. The closest bank for your anchovies is this building right here. So it's fairly close to a bank. You're going to hold on to these fish so that you can level up your cooking and cook eventually sharks. Now that you have caught 115 anchovies, you will now move on to trout. From Taverly Bank, you run out, you run across the bridge with the pumpkins on it. Once you cross the bridge, just continue going straight. You're going to hit the water, turn right, a few steps later, you're catching trout. You are going to need to take every trout that you catch and take it back to the bank. To go from level 20 to level 30, you are going to need to catch 346 trout. Remember when I said we're going to cook our anchovies and our trout? I am in the Lumbridge Bank. You load up with whatever you're wanting to cook. I just have lobbies, but what you need to do is cook your anchovies. And then once you become leveled enough, you can cook your trout. Come down here to the fire. Cook your inventory and it is crucial 
that before you move on from this point, you have to have level 30 cooking. The next step will not work unless you have level 30 cooking. To get to the closest salmon fishing spot, you go to East Folly Bank, you run into the garden area, you head over to this bridge, and you have a salmon fishing spot. Once you are full of salmon, you now head to this building right here, and you cook your salmon, and you have the option if you want to bank the salmon, you can do that, or if you just want to keep blasting through, you can throw your salmon down on the ground and keep fishing so that you can get to the coveted lobsters, swordfish, and sharks. To get to lobsters, you have to go to Catherby. In order to get there, you have to cross the White Wolf Mountain. The entrance to the mountain is right here. You just follow the trail and it will spit you out at Catherby. All right, so welcome to Catherby Bank. We are fishing lobsters. To get to lobsters, you head over back towards White Wolf Mountain. And you have a lobster spot right here. So we're gonna fish lobsters from level 40 to level 50. You need 972 lobsters to accomplish this. And you bank every single one of your lobsters. So you're just past Sears Village. You're coming up and here we go. We have the fishing guild. Welcome to the fishing guild. Really don't care about much on this side as of yet. But you come over here and you have a bank. Woohoo! Actually have a bank in here. Right up here. This little building right here is where the bank is. Ta da! Swordfish are super easy. From the bank, you just run out, you grab your load of swordfish, and you bank it, and you keep all of them. You do need a harpoon to catch swordfish. If you haven't bought one yet, and you've got the gold for it, there is a vendor on the docks that will sell you one. Once you catch 1,630 swordfish, you should be level 60. At that point, we're going to leave, and we are going to go start fishing monkfish at Entrana. To get to Entrana, you go here. The building is called the Barber Shop. You speak with one of the guys in here, and he will give you passage to Entrana for 50 gold. Once you have reached Entrana, you walk straight forward, and you are going to come to a bank deposit box, or in this game, a bank deposit, where you can put any of your fish that you catch you can give them to this guy and they will be directly deposited into your bank. To get to the monkfish, you continue down the path. You're going to find some necrotic bushes and you follow them. You're going to have some sea turtles and you have multiple places that you can fish monkfish at and run them back and bank them with the bank depositor. You will need 5,840 monkfish to go from level 60 to level 75. Once you reach level 75, congratulations, you made it to the big money maker, sharks. Once you hit 75 and you want to start making that money, head to the fishing guild. You can see here where the sharks are to be fished and how close you are to the bank. Once you fish your sharks and you need to start cooking them, you're going to need to cook all of your lobster, your swordfish, and your monkfish. And that should get you right close to 75 cooking. And again, the best place to do that is back at Lumbridge Castle. If you made it to the end of the video and you enjoyed it, hit the like button. If you want to see more videos like this, hit the subscribe button. If you want to watch my most recent video, click on the bottom left.